If you'd like to see how I'm going to transform this plain bottle of Tito's Handmade Vodka into this lovely, sparkly, glittery bottle as a DIY birthday gift, keep watching this video. Hey YouTube, so today in this video, I'm going to be adding some glitter to this Tito's Handmade Vodka bottle. Um, it's really plain, but I noticed that it does have like a nice little rose gold top on it. And I have this glitter here that I thought would be very pretty with it. I actually used this glitter a couple times. I kind of didn't want to use it because I used it a couple times before. But I'll be using some Mod Podge to apply the glitter and you will also need a sponge brush to apply the glitter. Um, and also another thing about this glitter, I did a Douce bottle and it was so, so pretty. Now anyway, you're gonna just start to apply thin amounts of glue to the bottle. It's all up to preference, but you can cover up the label in the back. I usually do when it's glitter. And you just wanna make sure the, the glue is nice and smooth. And you just go ahead and start to shake on your glitter. Now I purchased this glitter for $7.99 from Michael's Craft Store. And chunky glitter is like my, my new thing. Like I love it. I usually used to only work with fine and extra fine glitters but I feel like this chunky glitter has a different type of sparkle to it and I just love the thickness of it now because it's so chunky and thick I do tend to only use one coat of it because it just doesn't need any more than that in my opinion so I'm just going to continue to just fill this bottle up and it, it turned out to be a really nice DIY birthday gift for a friend of mine um, she turned 45 years old and this Tito's bottle let me just say um, people talk about this a lot and I see that people like drink this or whatever I expected it to cost more so I can't remember how many milliliters this bottle is but this bottle was only $15 I was expecting for it to cost more because it's so popular but you see it doesn't take long at all I'm gonna add glitter to the top part of this bottle and once I cover the whole bottle in glitter, I was in a hurry because I was headed to her dinner party. Um, I had probably like an hour to work with. Just to let you know, these don't take that long. But I do have like a really high powered floor blower fan. I put that bad boy in front of that fan. I let this dry while I threw my, uh, my dress on um, for about 20 minutes, 15 minutes. Then I did have to go ahead and, and seal it. We'll get to that part later, um, but you just go ahead and shake the glitter on and get all the way to the top. And it's this bottle, um, very lightweight, very nice, and just let it dry. The longer you let it dry, the better, of course. But if you have a high power fan, that'll speed up the process. Now another thing comes in handy to have is a nice little fluffy brush with nothing on it. So you can just dust off that excess glitter. So that way with the fall off you don't need, you'll see what you're working with and if there are some areas that need extra glitter added. Now this is a product I like to use called Tri Art Liquid Glass to seal the glitter. But if you don't, don't worry, just use Mod Podge. I just don't prefer to use that. Now this product is very thin and like a runny consistency so I I just go ahead and pour it directly onto the bottle and just blot it on with my sponge brush. That's how I like to do it. You can use a brush, you can use your finger, however, whatever works best for you. But you see how it's nice and runny? And I think that's why I like this product. My podge is good, but it's really thick. And to me, it takes away from my shine. So if I'm gonna use glitter, I wanna have the most maximum sparkle possible, you know? And for me, that's what this product does. I paid $60 for this big jar. You don't need to buy a big jar. I use it for my canvases and other DIYs as well. That was about a year and a half ago. And for some reason, I looked this up to like provide a link for someone. And it said $120. I don't know what that's about. But you could find a smaller bottle of this for probably about $8 to $10. Or you can use Mod Podge and just add glitter to it and maybe a pinch of water to thin it out. But I'm almost finished and I did let this dry another 20 minutes in front of a high powered fan. A 
Okay, you guys, here is the final finished result of this vodka bottle. And the glitter really complemented the color of the label and the color of the top. Now, you don't have to complement the color of the label or the top if you don't want to, because like, for example, if your friend or your color, your favorite color, whoever you're making this for, it's pink, do it pink. If they like blue, do it blue. Whatever color you want to roll with, that's what you do. I just liked how this kind of pulled in with the label and the top. I gave it to my friend and she absolutely loved it. Love, love, loved it. And her friends at her dinner party loved it as well. And that's the cool thing about these little bottles like this. If your friend or whoever likes a certain drink, well, if they like a bottle that costs like a little more, like maybe 50, 60 bucks or like a hundred dollar bottle then it can get more expensive but they like something that's not so much on the expensive side like this 15 bottle 15 dollar bottle of vodka or if they like like a five dollar bottle of wine adding some glitter to it really makes it nice and sparkly and just pretty because they can hang it up um where they can sit it on their mantelpiece they can sit it anywhere and it's definitely something cute to look at especially if they're into sparkly cute stuff um and then also if you don't want to put any glitter on it and you have extra time like that, you can put rhinestones on it. I've done a rhinestone bottle before. It took a very long time. Um, but yeah, that's another option. But this is a quick, a quick DIY that you can definitely do if you only have about, if you're working with about an hour before you have to be somewhere and you just didn't think about it. Um, this is a great DIY to do. So I hope you guys found this video useful and helpful. Thank you for watching. Um, give this video a thumbs up. Share it on Facebook just to get it out there. I greatly appreciate that. Hello to all my new subscribers. Hello to all of my subscribers. And you can follow me on Instagram at life is a whole vibe if you like to. And there's underscores in between each word. And it's the same name on TikTok as well. Thanks again, you guys. Bye-bye. Check out our website, myworldradiance.com, and we do carry full leather-inspired designer fabric for your crafting needs, luxury-inspired croc charms, as well as iron-on patches, and much more. Enjoy the coupon code, myroyalbeauty 10 off. Check out our website, crtacticaldefense.com, where we do sell in waistband gun holsters, belly band holsters, and many more. Please check out my discount code, Vibes, for a special discount for my subscribers.